Hey guys, today we're gonna to be doing a really quick review and demonstration of the X-Nano projector. This is a native 1080p projector that they recently sent out to me for this review and unboxing. So on the back here, they advertise that it is native 1080p, has 8K decoding, an autofocus feature, keystone correction, dual speakers, an Android OS with Wi-Fi capable of 2.4 to 5 gigahertz, built-in Chromecast, Bluetooth, and Google Assistant. So we have a lot of features in this thing. Let's go ahead and open it up and see what comes inside the box. So first up, it looks like we get the remote, the power cable, quick start guide. It comes with an HDMI and a little riser to screw into the projector. We have a ton of foam in here. So it seems to be packaged very well, so it should stay nice and safe. This projector is actually a pretty decent size here. It's definitely a little bigger than I thought, but the build quality is really nice. Let's go and get all the plastic off of here and uh, take a closer look at this thing. All right, right here is where you screw in that riser. You don't have to use it, but I'm gonna go ahead and screw it in here before I lose it. So the front has a pretty cool fabric, kind of a silver design on the outside and the perimeters, then a solid black on the top. You guys get some buttons on the top there to control things manually. Two HDMI ports, an AV port, an audio jack port, and two USBs. You guys have sensors for the remote on the front right there and on the back, and that's where you plug it in. So when you guys take this little panel off, you guys get access to the built-in Chromecast. So that's a really cool touch there. I'm gonna go ahead and plug this back in. And that's just a closer look of the actual bulb. On the side here, we have a filter for the intake and that's pretty easy to clean. The remote that comes with this goes to that little Chromecast that's built in. So you guys have access to some apps down there, volume controls on here as well. And you guys also have just your normal standard remote features like volume and pause and even a home button. It didn't come with batteries though, but it will take two AAAs. Now let's go ahead and plug this in and take a closer look at it and see just how bright it is. All right guys, so we have it plugged in. We turned off some of the lights in our room. Right now we're just connecting it with the Google Home app so it's pretty easy to set up. I'll see you guys once it's done setting up though. All right guys, so we're done setting it up. Right now I have it set up at about 40 inches, so not too big, but it's probably the best way to show you the actual quality. So I have a few lights on in my room right now and it's still very bright. So definitely impressed with how bright it is. The autofocus did a really good job too. So despite this being on a textured wall, the text is super sharp there. So I'm definitely impressed with the brightness and the sharpness. This definitely looks like a real 1080p projector. You guys can play 4K footage on here, but it will be downscaled to 1080p. So I just finished setting this up. You guys have all the apps already downloaded as soon as you guys connect it to your Google Home account. It's very responsive as well. And so far, this is probably the most user-friendly smart projector I've used. So I'm definitely really excited about actually using the Chrome stick. The speaker on this projector is actually pretty impressive as well. It'll definitely be loud enough to fill up the room. All right, so here's just some quick footage that I recorded a while back. And this is really impressive. The color is super bright. So this should just give you a better look at the actual projector quality. I will say the fan definitely is fairly loud, but that's a good thing because it is doing a good job at extracting a lot of that heat. So anyways, I'm pretty impressed with this projector. Also on the top here, we have like RGB lights that are kind of rotating through colors for the buttons. So that's a really neat feature. So anyways, that's just my really quick review of this X-Nano 1080p projector.